all right so what is going on today youtube is today is tuesday and we're going to be playing some dino mist today so sit back and enjoy uh this will be the last time i'm playing this deck today thank you to Dwayne mcfadden once again for um giving us the deck list shout outs to him go check his channel out and all that but yeah today's the last day we're going to be playing dino mist and hopefully we can open up with dino mist howling what a charge and dino i really thought this was a dino mist card then for no reason they made this a, dyna a dynamic card. Like, damn, man, that's just stupid. Like, why would you not just make it dynamis? But this card is terrific. This is the exact card I was looking for in a in a previous duel I was playing with. And I, I literally couldn't, like, I summoned Tehran. I was like, I need something that negates effects. But this is not a dynamis card when I just barely read it. Because I was thinking, why the f it's not showing me that I could actually search this card. But then I, I looked at the name and... Yeah, it, it's not a Dynamis card. I really thought this was a Dynamis card the whole time because I figured, um, where is he at? Where is his name? This one. I figured because this was on the field giving us a 300 boost and because this is a Dynamis card, this is in my head. I'm thinking, all right, so we're getting already an extra. It's pretty much extra 400 boost. That's what I thought in my head. I mean, technically it is counting itself. So technically like a 500 boost. I'm thinking that in my head. So I'm like, fuck, like, you know, I'm, I'm really wondering, like, all right, is there another glitch in Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro where I can't surge it? But, man, it's a dynamic card, which, I, I, I oh, a dynamic, oh, that's, that was supposed to be the, oh, I'm, I'm done. All right, so we're going to just hop, hop straight into these duels. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for clicking on the video. Hope you guys do enjoy it. Leave a like, leave a comment, and also subscribe to help the channel. And if you guys can, uh, click it out to help support the channel. And I'll thank you very much. And we, here we go. Start off the duels. All right. So here we go against Vikings. And yeah, we finally won the die roll. And we have not opened it up. But we can get to Ron. So let's go ahead and set this. That's 2000D. But damn, they, they, they really fucked up a, a, a beautiful card for Dynamis just for a fucking pun. Damn, that's just that's the same shit as Spirals. I really hate when like now that that irritates the shit out of me. When Konami does that, I thought they only did with Spy Gal, and I was like, you know what? I, I could kind of see it because if, if Spy Gal was a spiral, that card would be. I mean, it would, it, it would be very very good. I mean, it's already still a good card, but if it was a Spy Gal, since it's not once per turn, you could really just spam it off. So I kind of understand that, but why? What? What is a feel like really? You you made it dynamic, huh? This this <laughs> that's so fucking cool to fucking say, isn't it? Dynamic, a dynamic goddamn field card. You know what? I'm gonna let this ride. And the only reason I'm gonna let this ride is because I do not want this motherfucker to trish me. That's not what I'm trying to deal with right now. So I'm gonna let this ride real quick, and then during the end phase, hit him with the young Tehran. Uh, where are you at? And, and shout out to Dwayne McFadden for telling me, yes, the P is silent, which I, you know, I, I could see because they are based on dinosaurs. So I'm guessing, you know, the Tyrannus, I mean, ooh, please be a six. It's not a six. Why are you not a six? Why are you not a fucking six? God damn it. I thought this was a six. So I'm thinking we can, we can do some th good, good things. What is this? Well, I guess we can just bring that on board. Um, okay, I know what I can do. We can get over both. So what we're going to do here... Oh, wait. Wait, what? Oh, if another... No, I want to cancel... Oh, fuck it. I got to do it. All right, I had to do it anyways. I had to do it this way. I had to do it that way because if I even if I even if I did it the other way, um, he wouldn't have actually been able to die. So, and then the, the reason why I did all that is because I'm trying to uh, put my hand down so I don't get trished, because that is a fuck of a card. Even a, a, like just getting trished is is just ridiculous. I I really did not enjoy getting trished, but <clears throat> he drew another Sinju, ripped it right off the top. But yeah, man, back to this damn dynamic. Oh, just supposed to be dynamic. It's supposed to be just real fucking funny to fuck up an archetype. Or, you know, just like they just literally cut a card for no reason. 
that you literally can't search without terraforming, which is completely stupid, I believe. And so what I think is going to happen right now is he's going to, you know, drop a, uh, he's going to drop a young, uh, ritual. I'm going to let him attack over this and then hit him with the young, the young man known as, uh, okay, never mind. He's just going to get hit with it right now. And what can this do? You can send a Necroz. Okay, yeah, you're going to get hit a deep prison right now. And hopefully we can draw a charge or a howling. Uh, that would be very amazing. Preferably, I want a howling. So it'd be, it'd be all right. I thought this said, oh, if it gets banished, huh? Yeah, if it gets banished, you can do that. So, all right, now he is going to attack. Yeah, you're definitely getting deep prison today, folks. Should I even deep prison? To be honest with you, I don't even know because then it's going to, no, fuck it. Yeah, we, you're going to get deep prison. Probably has the Trish in his hand. Does he? I'm thinking, oh, he doesn't have the Trish. Okay. And then now you're going to get a search for another ritual spell, which is completely fine. Hopefully he does not have enough for gun year, which I'm thinking he actually does because I mean, yeah, he can just use kaleidoscope, correct? I believe he can just use kaleidoscope to drop him. No, he can't. Okay. Well, we got a victory. All right, here we go. And this is going to be a match against player, even though we don't have any side. Yes, yes, yes. We've opened up pretty good. I enjoy this hand. Because it's not too many monsters, and it's we got a howling. Howling makes every hand better. Sadly, we're not going first, but you know what? I'm kind of, I was contemplating starting to go second, but once again, howling is just so. God damn it, we're playing against the the actual dinosaurs, but we have the machine dinosaurs, and we've drawn double. And a whoa, Dude, are you seriously doing this? God, man, this shit irritates the hell out of me. Like, why are you doing this? Why, why, why? Don't tell me you have that. Yeah, I'm thinking like, what, 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 what the fuck are you even doing, sir? Um, yeah, I don't know what the hell this man was even attempting to do. That was horrible. And oh, that we open up busted. We really? Okay, so he's gonna add it now. Now he's going to use Lithogasm, correct? He's going to use Lithogasm? Yeah, there it goes. There's Lithogasm. Because it's not it's not a good duel unless he does have Lithogasm. Oh, okay. Okay, so you just that's a free VFD. But you know what? VFD is fine. I'm not tripping about VFD. I'm not tripping about anything he actually puts on this board. Because I do have this Dynamis Howling. And we're going to get things situated. Well, we're going to get a lot of things situated. So he can just pop, pop. That's fine. Actually, that is 100% fine. Okay, never mind. It's not complete fine. Because he's going to add the missile. Ah, miscellaneous source. And what? Unaffected by your opponent's activated effect. Sure. And he did the dumb shit once again because he, for some reason, did not want to exceed first to clear up his room. Okay, I, I don't understand with these people. I don't understand it. Why even, like, you, you're just literally fucking up all your plays. Like, you, like, man, you had two effects that you just missed out on because you didn't want to do nothing. All right, you make everything Earth. Ha, 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 that's cool. That's all right with me. I'm not tripping. Um, okay, so wow, none of these can activate. I didn't know that. I can't even summon any of these cards. Well, folks, it looks like we're going to go ahead and take the L on this one. A uh, two. Does it die at the end of the turn or something? Oh, okay. And then you get a, um, what? A dinosaur, a Dorgoron. That's fine. Drowning. That's even, that's the greater, that's the greatest card I ever drew. That is a good card right there. 
and even though we can't do anything we can sure set everything and we can be fine with that we can be real fine with that now the waiting game he top deck he top deck the best card in a fucking deck which is terraforming uh, can he even search anything you play more okay wait that's three okay well I mean I guess you can do that so yeah we're gonna survive here folks we're gonna survive because I have this howling I can get to protected by battle then I can um, use Howling to pop this back. Then I can Dino Miss Rush on my opponent on my turn. Tribute it to pop this back. Yeah, I don't care. You're probably gonna pop this. Yeah, and you search the water one, like I said, which I don't care about. And what are you gonna do? Make everything water. Okay, so what does the water one do? Okay, does this what which one some of them trigger you can destroy your opponent's card. This card is in your hand, you can destroy two other more okay, and if you do spell someone if you do you can banish up to two spells and trap your opponent controls. Okay. Well, since that doesn't target, hmm. You know what? That's fine. I'm gonna let him activate the effect. Because once you activate the effect, I'm gonna chain Howling and Dynamis and force him to tribute, force him to tribute these cards off the board. There we go. So let's go ahead and. Oh damn it! That was an accident. So let's activate this. You are a fucking sad. Why can't I do this? Fuck. Well, folks, I'm pretty sure he's gonna tribute these two. I I I probably. Mm, mm, there's nothing really I can do about that one. He's gonna tribute those two though. And then I can. Why is what? Why? Why? What the fuck? You can destroy two, including the water monster. And if you do, I, can somebody tell me why he tributed my monsters? I don't know why he tributed my monsters. Like, it it doesn't it doesn't really make sense to me. Is it this? What makes it be able to tribute my monsters? I don't know. Oh, there's a D prison. But we can't do anything. Because for some odd reason, Howland can't activate the same chain it was activated on. Oh, because it's technically not faced up yet. Alright. Alright, so. I was wrong about that one, folks. And it looks like I'm wrong about this one, too. Um, Let's go ahead and do this. I'm scared to even activate cards. Ghost Ash. Okay. You Ghost Ash. Oh, man. Well, let's do that. Well, it looks like we're not going to win this one either, folks. I know he's going to open up Fossil Dig, Terraforming, or something. Cosmic Cyclone. Okay, well, let's just go ahead and use this. And let's go ahead and do... Where's our strongest guy? There's the highest defense. I want to get a Tehran on the board, though. Which one has 22? Oh, Rex has 22? And I think I want to. I'm gonna get Rex. And you know we're gonna leave it in attack mode. Fuck it. All right. So with four cards, can you whip my ass? I I don't know what the hell. I, no, okay. Well, there's terraforming. There's I done. I mean that kills one card in his hand. Oh, it's probably gonna be one of them dinosaurs. And then it's oh, okay. There's fossil dig terraforming. Jesus Christ. Go ter, listen. His hand. With, with only four cards, four cards were literally 
terraforming fossil dig ghost ash cosmic cyclone and did he not search the fucking four star did he not wow why, why would I mean you can still get it off of this I guess but I didn't understand that Oh, okay. Never mind. He did it right. He did it completely right. I'm the all right. Well, it looks like we're not gonna go ahead and finish this one out, folks. It doesn't look like we're gonna win this one. But we can try. We can try, man. We can definitely try. We can definitely fucking try. <laughs> But this, yeah, we I don't, yeah, we're not gonna, we're not gonna be able to get out of this one. You wanna get another baby swords? Pop both. Oh my god. This is oh, it just as long as he doesn't end with what's the name, I think we're cool. As long as he doesn't end with uh, what at the Naturia Beast, I think we're cool. And even if he doesn't win Naturia Beast, we I, no, we can't attack. No, we sure can't, huh? So I mean, just we just gotta pray he just doesn't end with Entrebies. Okay, I mean this is I mean, we can't really. Never mind. I, I was about to say something too. I said we can't really go into level fours, but literally we got like twelve level fours in this deck, and they all can be pendulum summon. It does look like he's going to Entrebies though. So I mean, that uh, shuns my plans right now. Right, right in the sides. Wait, can he? Yeah, you can. No, I don't think he. Wait, whoa, I don't think he can. He can go VFD for sure. But I definitely don't think he can do what's the name. Yeah, I don't think he can do it because. Hmm. He would need he would need another true Draco in his hand, to do it. Because he can go. He can Trish me. And he's probably going to target this. Um, just don't hit the Regeki. Don't hit the Regeki. Don't hit the Regeki. Actually, he's going to get rid of charge. Oh, he actually did it. And he hit... Oh, he... Wow, that... That might have saved me. That might have saved me, folks. He thought he can get rid of this. That really might save me. He can banish four. He can go into... What's the name? He can go to Tyranno Infinity. Um... Is it Tyranno Infinity? I think it is. Banish for it. If you have 4,000, I'll take 16, get it back. 16, uh, and this is six. No, this is 55, so that's 71. So we possibly can stay alive, unless he just puts 900 more damage on board. Or he doesn't play Tyranno Infinity, which will help me out tremendously. Did this man just quit? Why would you quit with such an astonishing board? Oh, he can go VFD with those two, can he? Can't he? Why? Well, it literally does not let me see VFD, even though he summoned it. See, look. Opponent declare Earth. Yeah, but it doesn't tell me what 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 use it. That's that's stupid. That's completely stupid. Like, why would it? Okay, I believe he can go VFD with these three. These two, I mean. I think it's just two level nines. And does he play it? Does he play the big man? Time limit is up. Wow. Hold on, let's see if he does play it. All right, folks, so look look, look at his hand. Look at this hand. He had double cosmic cycle. He had double cosmic cyclone. Wait, what? It was it? What's at the top? Okay, he had, no, he had one. That is a beautiful hand. All right, so VFD requires what? Um, yeah, two or more level nine monsters, which is just fantastic that he was going to be able to drop. He does play Tyranno Infinity. All right, so it looks like I believe that was going to be it. Um, let's see what, what was going to end up happening. Uh, I just want to see what, what was going to happen after the Tyranno Infinity. Uh, not the Tyranno Infinity, but after this. What was going to happen after everything what was I drawing I was going to draw a cosmic cyclone that I couldn't use 
But you know what? It's all right. We got one one to two more duels. All right, so here we go. And we have won the die, uh, rock, paper, scissors. I keep thinking die roll, but it's, and we've once again opened up a whole bunch of stuff we can't use. Um, but oh, fuck, I just need a howling, man. Just give me the howling and I'm, I'm straight. But man, I, I really can't believe, I always thought that that field card really said Dynamis. I really did. I really thought that that field card said Dynamis this whole time. And there's the howling. All right. So what does it say? All right, so if all cards I control are Dynamis, I could just special summon this card. There we go, that's cool. And then it says, Banish any monster destroyed by a Dynamis I control. So I'm guessing this should trigger still. Yes, this it gets banished. That's cool with me. And now we got a Dynamis Howling, and we're just, we're 100% straight. You know, we can go even further. And I think that's what we're going to do here, folks. We're going to go further. Wiretap, you sack of shit. Oh, you're playing hat. That's cool. Well, you know what? I'd rather you hollow tap. Uh, I was about to say hollow tap. I'd rather you wiretap that than that dynamis howling. Wow. I can't believe I, com I, I put those both together. I, I, I go ahead and spell book crescent because you're cool, right? Let's activate that right now. Don't hit me with another wiretap. Thank God. All right, here we go. All right, so Brachion and Spinos, correct? New, you know what? Let's not let's not do that because I keep fucking up doing that. That's a scale of six. So let's go ahead and get a scale of three, which is. Nope. That's where's the other one? This one. Nope. That's it. Oh shit! I almost fucked up. Where the fuck is the fourth? There we go. Yeah. Let's go. Let's do that. Then this destroys, and then this is targeting, correct? Yes. We, 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 and look at this. We drew drowning when we got monsters. Um, okay. You don't even have any of those cards. So now you can't. Um, yeah, let's just do that right now. Oh, he got the fate. He got the fate. No, he fucking got the wisdom. Wow. Sack of shit. Oh, oh wow. I thought he was getting what's the name. I thought he was getting fucking what's the name. Oh, man. I thought he was getting World of Prophecy. I thought he was getting World of Prophecy. Well, fate's fine. Fate is fine with me. I'm not tripping. He's probably going to use fate. No, he's not going to use fate. He's going to use that first. Okay, that's completely fine. Um. Yeah, let's destroy Brachion. And, and look, we got the drowning sitting here, but we can't do anything about it. No, let's not do that. But you know, we are set up. We are set up, so that's that's cool. But you know what's not cool? Drawing into a Dino Mist Rush. <laughs> when we need a damn level fucking... Uh, when we need a damn rank 6. That sucks. Well, we can hit him with his Drowning, though, which is going to feel so good. Which is just going to feel... Oh, just proper. This is real proper. Oh, God. What are you doing? You're going to put back to... you going to put back to Howling? Um, sure. I'm not tripping about that. Why would you do that? That's You're just giving me a monster to use. Like, you're literally giving me a monster for no reason. Like, I have nothing. I have nothing. You, and you just gave me a free monster I can attack you with. And I know what you have set, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I know you have that fate set, so like I can easily just run your shit over. No, we're not going to do that. We're going to go for the kill shot. Oh, there we go. Oh, 
Yo, excuse me. I was, what's the name? I was, old, <laughs> I was trying to burp, but I wasn't trying to burp into the mic. So sorry for that. Sorry for the uh, for the for the lack of talking, but not trying to burp into the mic. And we have game because where is Udynamis Rex? Because I love him. We'll, see, man, when we draw howling, we just do. We just we we're, we're just there. We we get everywhere we need to be with howling. Howling is literally what we need every time, every single time we need this card. And uh, you know what? Since this is the last week, we're definitely going to get one more duel. So yeah, be right. Back. And alrighty, folks, here we go against the Dang. And the Dang wants to play asshole and pick scissors. And we have not opened up that, but we have opened up charge, which is amazing, which is good in itself. And we're going to get a Tehran. That's exactly what we're going to get. Matter of fact, we don't need a Tehran. Um, hmm. But you know what? We can use Tehran, huh? Um, where are you at? Yeah, let's get you. Let's get you. And we can only activate one Dynamis Rush per turn? Why? Why is that even... Man, they give us such limitations. Like, I don't... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna continue. I'm just gonna let it go. Because... There's no, there's no reason to keep, continue to... I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain. Because it it's still unfair. It's still so unfair. Like, some decks just get once per turn clauses for no reason at all. Just for no reason at all, get once per turn. Okay, well, I have no qualms about this, what he's about to do. You know what, I think that I might strike the shit out of him. Nope, um, mm, mm, no, I'm not going to waste my strike on that. I'll take that. I'll take that, folks. Oh, shit, that messed up again. Um, hmm. Let's just set this. End of turn. Let's go ahead and put that Medion right back. Go ahead, Medion. Go back to the deck. So he's playing the Time Lord deck. Oh, why did they not let me? Okay. They didn't even give me an option to go to end phase. Damn, come on, Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro. Could easily be, you know, establishing my, you know, my, my, my what's the name right now. I could easily be establishing my turn. Easy, not not my turn, but my setup. I can easily be establishing my deck to get where it needs to be to start gaining a massive amount of advantage. But I can't do that when. All right. So which one of these is activate regardless? You can tribute one other. This card can attack your opponent directly. Oop! We're going Spinos. Spinos is twenty five fucking hundred. Jesus. Damn, that's five fucking thousand. You can, I can only do that in the main phase. Well, that's that's cool. You know what? That's cool. I'm not even gonna trip about that. That's actually okay. And and look at that. He just perfectly hits what what the fuck I needed to be set. Ain't that some shit? Isn't that some fucking shit? The dang. Dang. Why you had to do all that? But it looks like we have this victory in a... In, in, yeah, we just have this victory. Um, we just normal summon this, I guess. They get a free dynamis charge. Um, sadly, we don't have any more monsters. Sadly, this is only during the main phase. Which sucks. Which really sucks. Not the best. Thing. Well, you do you see what I'm dealing with? I mean, I could have easily activated both rushes, but they did not let me. So, I can't even. I can't complain. I can't complain. I mean, I can't complain, man. I hate when the Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro does that. Like, you have shit to activate the interface, and they do not let you even have the option to do it. But you know what? I should be holding this available. What do you do? Oh, wow, now that's a good effect. That is a good effect. But you know what? Do, do I care? I actually don't care. 
Uh, at the end of the battle phase, the card battle, you have less than... Yeah, I don't care. You can go back to 4,000. That's fine. The uh, reason why I let them do that, because I easily could have stroked it. You, you sack of shit. But that, like I said, that's fine. Yeah, I don't care. Because it, like, it doesn't really matter. I could regeki him then scale. Oh, it goes back to the deck. That's that's smart. Regeki him, scale, and just attack twice. Right? Yeah. Regeki, scale, attack twice. Then that's the end of that. So this is a three. Let me be let me be sure because I, I, I do fuck up with my pendulum summon. I do fuck up with my pendulum summons. I'm guessing this is me at yeah, main phase. Um, no, we're gonna attack twice. Yeah, that that's five thousand. I did real. I really, I really didn't know that shit did that. I really thought Rex was the only one with like the double attack and shit. I really did. But we have got a victory and the last, um, the last what's the name, the last video in the Dynamis history. Not Dynamis history, but. This is going to be the last video for uh, these couple of uh, we. Hold on, I'll be right back because I, I really don't know what the fuck I'm saying. But yes, the last video for Dynamis as of right now. And so if they get more support or if I want to dive back in and change a couple of cards around or, you know, add some cards, or, you know, do do something else with it. I'll definitely hop back in. I did have a lot of fun playing it, though. I did like it. Dynamis Howling is a real good card. It's sad that we don't have more cards for this deck to be searching with, but like I said, it is an overall good deck. It's just um, the only thing I would say that is, um, I guess, something. I guess to say a critique about the deck, what I didn't like is just, just the lack of, you know, keeping the, the, basically the the lack of getting this card is what I really didn't like. But um, when you when you don't when you when you don't have this card, I mean, it's very it's very hard. It's very hard to keep up with your opponent. So yeah, that's pretty much my only thing about that. Um, and then like. If we do exceed, there's nothing to get them out of the graveyard. So, I mean, if they had like another, like if they had like a, a spell card that says, okay, you can add a dynamis from your graveyard to your hand, or you know, put two dynamis, or if there's a card that says put two, put two cards from your graveyard, two pendulums back into the extra deck, something like that, they would really make this deck a lot. Basically, they can keep up a lot because they they basically would not lose a lot of advantage. But then. As I think about that, that's pretty broken for pendulums. To just put two pendulums from your graveyard back to the extra deck would be very, very broken. But I guess you can make a dynamic specific then, or not a, please don't make it dynamic, dy dynamic. Just make it dynamist specific, and then that would be pretty cool because this deck really needs something to um, get the, like, if you try to exceed with them or do anything else with them, or something to just like charge is good, but and like I said, we don't we I didn't draw charge too much. Howling is great. We didn't draw howling so much, but like I said, the deck is good once it once it gets its two the two best cards in the deck. The deck is good. So as you see, we we did win. So once we get like multiple of these going, then we're we're all good. So yeah, that is it for today. For and, and you know uh, another thing before we end the video is when the new pendulum rules come out. It's I don't, I don't even know really what you can do with this deck because if you scale you only have three spells and traps left and if you activate like one of you, you have one left so I, I don't know how this deck is going to survive because the new pendulum rules just completely shit this like just shut this deck the fuck down and it's and it's sad because it's like why would you introduce it okay we're not going to get on that rant because it's going to be another like a 40 minute video but thank you guys for watching. Shout out to Dwayne McFadden for sending the deck in. And I will see you guys tomorrow with another video.